Hello everyone, we're um, back to Song of the Deep. You might notice that we're actually in a different area than we were... Oh, Narwhal. Um, than where we ended last time. And that's because... Well, let's just say that the editing programs... Or recording programs, I should say. Decided to screw everything up for the episode that should have been the last episode. So, I got to the top of the tower. Got a couple more treasures. And got a nifty sonar device. And Marin also realized that the tower was used to hunt down the marrow. Which kind of explains why they're all gone. So, yeah, there's that. I also just bought myself a magnetic upgrade. Which apparently doesn't... That's weird, because I could have sworn I bought that earlier. Uh... Yeah. Anyway, so there's that. And otherwise, I've just been kind of... Mm -hmm. I've been just kind of... I treasured hundreds a couple of things that were over in this area. Still couldn't get to the those for some reason. Like, the doors were sealed. And I missed that up there, too. Well, I could always go back, at least, but still. Um... I like I'll, I'll do it off camera another time. But yeah, so all we had to do was go over to the teleport, come over to this teleport, or fast travel, then go down. Which we are going to, as soon as I try to get those treasures up there really quick. Actually, because maybe now the sonar will help me with that. Boop. I poked him in his butt and he exploded. Nope, still doesn't get rid of that guy. Ow, stop that! How oh, you stop that? And maybe this? Boop! Nope. Huh, how am I supposed to appease this guy? Oh, there's treasure in there. Yeah, there's a secret over there, but I'm not sure how to get to it. Oh, I'm gonna be in there, I guess. Yeah, I probably have to be in there. God dang it, how am I supposed to get rid of you, puffer fish? I shall blind you with my lights. I shall blind you! Anyway, moving on. Sorry, just a little weird tangent I'll going off on. But anyway, moving on. Like I said, and I keep saying, even though I shouldn't need to. And down we go, into the depths, with our new sonar device. Also, hello, Narwhal again. Stop that. Marin don't want none. Okay, so we're supposed to go to the right. Let's go to the left, just for a little exploration. Now the seahorse <gasps> sea is poking at a glass wall. It's such a strange creature, Marin thought. Boop -a -doop -a -doop. She wished she could understand what it wanted. Well, I can understand that it wants to go there. I'll get it in a couple of seconds, probably. Let's go over. Ooh, fancy. And then open sesame. Yeah, just As Marin approached the gate of the Forbidden City, the ah. clockwork seahorse warned her to stay away. But she had come this far and would not turn back. Exactly. Regardless of the danger that lay ahead. We laugh at the face of danger. Haha. <laughs> As the gate to the city opened, Marin was ambushed by Fomori sentinels. Oh, before that's she good. could react, they launched their torpedoes at the defenseless <gasps> clockwork seahorse. No! Marin watched in horror as its gleaming golden body was blasted into pieces that fell lifeless and dull. Not the seahorse. Why? Blinded by rage, Marin turned back to face the deadly sentinels. Kill them all! With explosions! Blow them up! Damn it, you bastards! I need some more time. Damn you. Damn you all. Damn 
wasn't exploding. Oh, I was gonna say, I wasn't exploding. Damn you all to hell! Also, really quick, because I can. Um, actually, here too. Oh, hello. Clam. I wonder where I'm supposed to read him. Something red, probably. Anyway, moving on. Seahorse, no! You were so gleamy. So life, full of life. And then you exploded. Why? We better be able to rebuild them. And whoop. Probably won't do anything, but... Yeah, I didn't think it would. Oh, treasure. But yeah, the seahorse was a nice little companion. It is a shame that he got blown up. It's not nice. Not nice at all. Famori, I shall blow your ship up. Wait, how am I supposed to, um... I get the feeling if I go right into it. Haha! I was faster! I was faster and smarter than you, Searchlight. Whose purpose is to uh, keep me from moving? And yet you failed at your purpose. How about no? Yay! More treasure! Good. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! I didn't realize there was a searchlight there. Got that one already. Hmm. Anything else? It was. Okay, well I can't pick that up. Can I blow it up? to do with that one? Oh, I guess whatever I get to break these glasses, maybe? Fomori are assholes, that's all I can say. I mean, they're real assholes. Oh, Mr. Crab! Hello. What are you doing? Collecting food? Okay. The forbidden city of the Fomori. Seem to be the destroyed, well, more destroyed city. This was the lost city of gold from her father's songs. But where were the Fomori? Probably uh, all dead because of their creations. You know, usual thing. More treasure. Haha. -ha. Gulp. Okay, so. Why don't we go all the way over there? Which is a very far distance from here. Hey, you tricked me. You tricked me. At you, at you, at you. Pardon me, at you. Excuse me. Well, I got that thing. But you tricked me. You told me there was treasure in there, and there was, eventually, but I had to fight many things to get it. And Vortex! So now I can go back down here, and then this thing a... Oh, where am I? Wait, that doesn't... Aw. Uh -uh. I thought I solved that problem. Okay, that's, uh... The heart of the Forbidden City lay behind two enormous, impassable gates. They were sturdy enough to withstand the strongest creatures of the sea. Marion hmm. was reminded of something her father once told her. When a problem seems unsolvable, approach it from another direction. Up above the heart of the city, 
lay the munitions factories. Oh, that's what that is. The weapon stockpiles were stacked in endless columns, awaiting a war that never came. Whatever had become of the Fomori, it must have been sudden. Yeah. And unexpected. Ah, there it is. I noticed it before the uh, radar. Oh, I can't get through it anyway. Never mind. Not until I get whatever breaks the glass. Oh. Darn you, jellyfish. Darn you, jellyfish. I will destroy you all, jellyfish. I will destroy you all. Destroy you all. Destroy you all. Especially you, Formori bastards. Haha. <laughs> Behold the power of my heat shield! Ow! He exploded. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Haha! <laughs> oh, that wasn't too bad. Nope, never mind, I can't do that. I'm supposed to put something there. I'm sure I'll find out what it is in a moment. Some sort of barrel. Updraft. Huh. Has to be here somewhere. He just has to. Despite its cold and ruthless nature, the Mori weaponry was sometimes quite beautiful. Even their kind of weird to say. round warheads pulsed with a mesmerizing glow. The Mori warheads were designed to trigger on sound or light. They were sturdy enough to be pushed around. But a single sonar pulse or a strong beam would activate the detonator. Whoosh. Ah, dang it. There's gotta be some way I can push it faster. And whoosh. Haha! -ha! I have solved your puzzle. And also, that is smoke under the water. Or oil, one with two. No, no! Oh, that was close. No! Ah! No! Okay, there we go. Uh huh, uh huh. Just push it slowly, delicately. And then down it goes. I actually meant to push it over there, but saving is to good works too. The vast riches and ever turning gears of the Forbidden City came with their own cost. Poisonous black soot poured out in unending columns, gradually filtering its way into every part of the sea. Ah, that's not good. Maybe they poisoned themselves to death. Okay. Good thing I can blow this up with my claws. So I don't have to worry about hitting them. Now, what might you be? You are a. Not entirely sure. Oh, you're a headpiece thing. Ah! Treasure. More treasure. Ah. <sighs> gotta say, this place has very lovely visuals. Oh god. Okay, so there's no way over there. I'm just blowing those up so I don't have to worry about them later. Oh god! Ow. That hurt. A lot. But luckily I survived. So huzzah! Huzzah, I mean. 
Oh, there's a full wall. Okay, never mind. Womp, 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 womp. Just keep rolling, 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 rolling. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Haha! You uh, jellyfish don't stand a chance against me! Ow. Uh, let's do that. Boo boo! Haha! Kaboom! 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 Ha! Victory is mine, jellyfish. Or not. Kaboom! Yay, victory is mine. Uh oh, ah, a little too close, a little too close. Don't blow up, don't blow up! Okay, I'm good. Now we'll just move you over this way. And then make you explode. Kabumi! Alright, so. I wonder. Oh, yeah. Where'd that come from? That's the question. Hmm, where did that come from? Because once I found out where that came from, then I could use it. Wait, so where'd that one that come that fell down here come from? Very much like to know that. Especially if I could um figure out how to pick it up and move it. Hmm. Puzzles, oh puzzles. And then, nope, not that way, not that way. Unless, maybe it is that way. I don't know, I'll, I'll figure it out. First off, let's go up here. Maybe. Just maybe. I get one from up here first. Like so. Oh, what's this supposed to open? Oh, I see. And then quickly... Dash it over, dash it over. And then... Come here. Haha! Puzzles ain't no match for me. No, my treasure collecting skills. Not sure why I did that. After some reason, I thought there would be like a secret over by this door. And then I'll just slowly roll you, um, slowly roll you over here. Down you go. And then onto the switch you go. And then explodes you make. And boop 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 boop. Oh, there's a secret. Oh, looks like the pathway is to the left, maybe. I'll figure it out. Oh god. You and your weird guardian head things. Lose you much. Gotta not do that. Oh, 
Dang it, I gotta do that again. Alright, let's try this again. And then off you go. And then exploding you do. Kaboom! Got the treasure once more. And oop. And I got the thingy. Then I push you down here. And actually before that, I think I will save and then continue this in the next episode and hopefully the editing or the recording program doesn't eat this episode. So yeah, if there's anything you liked, comment about it. If you got any suggestions, comment those for those too. Uh, subscribe if you want to see episodes from the past, present, and future. And until next time, hope you guys make it a great day, and I'll be seeing ya later.